there is a reason that Shostakovich is recognized as the greatest orchestral composer of the 20th century when the elite music world in the West was becoming totally introvert and producing music that was for looking at and analyzing more than it was for listening to. You know, music which is absolutely impenetrable to someone who just turns up and wants to hear has nothing to say to anybody really beyond the composer and a group of his very close associates. You know, that the Soviet Union produced an orchestral composer like Shostakovich at the same time that the West was producing these kind of Schoenberg 12 tone type of, you know, impenetrable nonsense. Um, and the capitalists, of course, will always say, even while they recognize his greatness, they will insist that he was great in spite of socialism. And of course, we contend that he was great because of socialism, because of the socialist content and inspiration of his work and the, the role that he was able to play in, in mobilizing and motivating the workers to build socialism, to fight fascism, to rebuild again after the defeat of fascism. You know, that's a noble calling. And it's something that people rise to when they have that mass audience and they're playing a meaningful role in social life, they will rise and produce their absolute best. And, you know, I think Shostakovich is one of many examples of that.